So what is going on guys, it's everyone 92 here, today I'll be doing the ban list prediction that I feel like the ban list is going to be coming out no longer than the, around February, probably the first weekend I believe so, or the second weekend before uh, YCS Vegas 3v3 and that is when the Hypernova will be coming out I believe on February Eight, that's when this when the park release and yeah so this is my band list um hope everyone enjoyed this and i'll explain my um explanation and yeah let's get straight into it so we're gonna have fairy statue um i would not be surprised this car will get banned um i don't know if this car will get hit i feel like this car will get hit um very soon but probably might not after hypernova since um they want uh, cashier play this card, and then after um, several months later, um, after one cashier is a deck, and then they're probably gonna hit this card um, to get banned. Cause like usually most uh, plunder player play only one copy of this card. This is kind of like a vending emptiness in a way. Uh, the second one masterpiece. I know this can be really crazy. I feel like there's uh, so many outs um, to masterpiece two today. And yeah, this is my like wish list, so hopefully it come off the list. I actually miss True Draco, you know. <laughs> um, but yeah, and then Maxi, this is kind of iffy. People will debate in either it should come off the list or it shouldn't. I feel like it should, cause uh, every format is getting faster and stronger than before. And OCG do have it. Plus, we don't have a structure deck in the trap trick very soon. I don't know when's the date, but uh, you guys do know. Put in the comments below. Um, it's really good for offensive and um, aggressive way. So if your opponent especially summon a monster, you max seed them. So they either go full combo or or they just stop because it's like getting punished, you know. And I feel like it will be a trade. You got so many outs. You got like Ash Blossom that's currently at three. You got Call by the Grave that's four. You got um. One, two, three, the cross out Destinator that's currently at three. So that's three, six, seven card outs to Maxi. And uh, yeah, let me know. I know this is debatable. <laughs> and plus, it's a, a balanced card as well. Uh, now we got two elements uh, Halfness. I believe they hit this at two in OCG. Um, maybe we we'll probably want to get two or one. I really hope this card gets hit to one because this card is super annoying playing on your opponent's turn as usual um and i was looking through ocg i believe they only hit this card the only did shizu um so they probably want to hit this one this card is also really good too and then toe they uh swap rock they're going to hit this one the one probably since the hypernova will have a support for the sprites that going to be really insane so yeah and then uh, gamma I would not be surprised this car is super good so good you get two monster itself and then the driver and then you're gonna make a, some kind of extra deck monster like omega or, or something like that um it's really good um uh, yeah this car has been way um off radar for a long time so yeah maybe hit to one who knows or maybe to put it to two and then the deer servant uh they hit this in ocg so i just say all right why not maybe uh, that kind of conflict to the TCG never know it that happened in the past long long time ago but not as um, ever since um, the new mechanic and stuff like that I believe so and this is also my wish list uh, Jan Juni you just return all spells and trap most of the time um, that's no big deal I guess not um, but it would be kind of cool you know like bring back um, that card kind of like back in the day they brought back snatch steel so just trying to make the game interesting and then put map to one because this is the most important card for the key card for plunder um, every time when you have this one you're in a winning position you're basically um, when your opponent summon a card a normal monster you chain and you summon your bird card and then you just play on your opponent turn and then you got the trap card as well so it's super irritating and uh, yeah and then uh right of a messier um this card will be coming being played more for the since uh hypernova is going to be coming right right around the corner as well 
and maybe this card is going to get hit one to two who knows um hopefully hit this card to one because this has also been a while since this card came out but probably um they want to make more reprints and then um hit this card afterwards now we got Prenderville planet um this card is insane you search card shuffle pop a card that's pretty strong plus gain 500 attack Hopefully to hit this card as well, mainly uh these two halfness and um proper plant then mass change two. This is also a really powerful card. You bring out dark law, very strong, and this card been um been up to three uh, copies for a long time since the structure deck of heroes. And then now we're going for the semi limited uh shifter uh two. I feel like this would be fine, um, or or one. Maybe they will probably hit this to two and then put it to one. Who knows? And then we got Triburgi on Fract um Tail or Fractal. Um, turn out uh, they also hit this in the OCG. This is still really um a broken deck, uh, the Triburgi deck or the Triburgi Sprites or something like that. I'm not quite sure, but it's currently dominating over there in the OCG. So yeah, so you guys better watch out for this deck, and then uh, we got two water attentress. Um, probably gonna hit this to two just in case, since uh, more people are gonna be um, start using the um the rights and the um water attentress combo again, and then sky striker um maybe engage. Who knows? Since sky striker is not currently doing anything at the moment, since they the Bishu stuff. Vanish and then you got the Shisu, the Shuffler, really, really insane. And then Brendan Fusion, maybe hit to one or two, maybe two. I believe the OCG also put this at two as well. Um, Despio's very strong deck. Um, if a Shisu was not a thing, Despio will be currently dominating um, this format, and it's been a while as well. And then we got Lightning Storm, two, um, the same reason as the OCG. And then uh, two diagram. Um, this is also my wish list as well. Um, it would be kind of nice having them. I miss play three you know. <laughs> and yeah, that's um. Oh, and I forgot. Uh oh, and the band section as well. I forgot to mention. Uh, Kikalos as well. This car should get banned because this car is insane. Yes, they actually hit this. This is the main key car. I feel like in Fusion, they could hit that, but turn out they're me ways to summon uh Kikalos as well and then ancient fear dragon hopefully this card come out one it's currently not doing anything at the moment i'm not quite sure if there's any crazy combo but yeah and then uh there's also my wish list uh shock master um normally not that many decks um play uh low four monster maybe maybe like um maybe some other decks but uh, mainly people go into like their fusion, um, that that kind of stuff like that. But um, maybe this might be so really good support for uh, Constellar slash Satellar Knight. Um, but yeah, this this card is already. I know this sound kind of crazy. If this card come off the list, but never know because Konami can be randomly. And then we got Lyris on um, Rekiko Starling. This card is not currently doing anything, so it can come off to three because I believe. Uh, there's two at the moment, and then I believe in the OCG they put it at three. This is my band list prediction. If you guys made the video, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe, turn on the post notification, comment below what do you guys think. Um, my band list, and yeah, all right, your boy Cyberborn Night Two is signing out. Peace.